Yes, Over. it's going to be uh, blood, gluts, snot, hard work, determination, glory. It's all in front of him. If he wants to achieve anything in life, the only thing we Furies know how to do is fight. That's it. It's the only thing down for us. Unless he wants to go and uh, mop some floors, clean out some toilets in McDonald's or something, then I suggest he better stick in south of France for Riviera and train like a Spartan. So, but I want to just go back over to Eddie for a second. Um, Eddie, Eddie, Fast Eddie Chambers has been to the pinnacle of the sport. He's been further than any one of us have ever even stepped in a ring before. This man has fought for the heavyweight championship of the world as a mandatory contender. This man has fought former world champions in he the heavyweight division. He's definitely been in the best in the division, hasn't he? No, no doubt about it. He's fought, 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 well. he's fought the best in the division. So I'm looking forward to working with Eddie. Not as a sparring partner this time, like he was against David A, but as a team member. So I can show me how to do this, 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 and this. I don't think I need to show you too much. <laughs> well, you know, it's going to be an honour learning from a man who's been further than me. So, I'd just like to say a big thank you for coming over, and we're all going to rub off on each other, and hopefully he's going to rub off on all of us, and we're going to be coming in the ring like this, <laughs> slick as like slick ricks, <laughs> all gel back hairs, gel everywhere, slick to the side. Peter's going to come lame with his uh, haircut yeah. like that. Yeah. He's going to be rubbing everybody off like that. <laughs> I'd like to. Uh, what I'd like to go to is our short, short-term goals, and I'm going to start with the quiet man over here in the corner, Kid Galahad. Someone already took me. Yeah, but Kid Galahad is a fighter from Sheffield, a good friend of mine. But I think that Huey deserves that name because he's more like the Elvis guy who plays in the movie, tall, dark, and handsome. Black hair, blue eyes, curbstone chin. The ladies <laughs> love him. <laughs> He's got it all. He's fully loaded, baby. You haven't got. <laughs> Top of the range. <laughs> 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 uh, but uh, yeah, I'd like to pass you over to Yui because I want to hear what Yui's short term goals are. And I want to hear some names. Who does he want? What does he want in 14? What does he want to achieve? And give us some names. Come on, you name somebody. Who do you want? Who are you calling out? Who are you looking for? Who are you hunting down? I'd like to fight camera. <laughs> I, I, that's my camera. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I'd like to fight uh, as many fights as I can this year. I want to step up. But uh, like again, I fight whoever my dad puts in front of me. He knows best for me. And I do want to fight uh, better opposition this year and uh, step up the game and uh, work for like get more experience and get the titles and everything and, but, and uh, hopefully I'll learn step by step which fight I get and whatever else but we don't direct in that uh, path. No, call out somebody. Who do you want? <laughs> Pussy. No, you're not interviewing that. No. Shouldn't be doing that. There's, there's no one. Listen, I respect every single fight that he is. Oh, we've got Mr. Knight here. Yeah. Whoever steps in the ring, they do serve respect. And uh, whoever jumps in the ring, my dad will pick and that's it. I, I can tell you everyone. I can tell you we're looking at some uh, some American <laughs> fighters at the moment for uh, February match <laughs> for Yui. And uh, he will be a step up and he will be stepping up considerably this year. You know, uh, that's where we're at. He's gonna train as uh, as hard. You know, last year when he boxed he was around sixteen um, he was 